Say man, hey man, it's your boy Do It All Harlem. We're back with another NBA 2K24 next gen build video. And today I have a special two way slash build for you guys that will be able to get gold posterizer Hall of Fame slithery. You still can shoot with this build, you can pass really, really good with this build, get your own shot, and you can play some defense. So make sure you guys watch the video to the end so I can show you this masterpiece. Choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before I go any further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know it's like button time, and I need you guys to go down there and hit that like button. Get this video to 100 likes. 100, man. You know what I'm saying? We ain't getting a lot of likes on these videos, man. Hit the like button for your boy. It's free to hit the like button. And don't forget to join the Discord. Uh, we have been growing over there. Now I need you guys to um, hit that button and hit the link in the uh, description. Six foot eight for this build. You can change the height if you want to. Totally up to you. One eight, one ninety five on the weight. Seven six wingspan. Let's get into it. So we're gonna go ahead and start with the finishing on this build. I know a lot of people are probably wondering what the finishing looks like for this build. And like I told you guys, we do get Hall of Fame slithery, which is a great bad. Some people are going to stop at ninety three, which is fine. You know, if you don't care about Hall of Fame Slithery, but I think Hall of Fame Slithery is legit. So, you want those contact dunks too. You don't get the contact dunks at 93. You get them at 94. Okay, so don't make that mistake of not taking your um, your dunk up high enough, okay? Now, um, we got a 76 on layup. I really wanted to get that up to an 80, but, um, you know, a 76 is pretty good. Uh, I think you still can make layups. My layup is at like a 47 on my uh, slash. It can go higher, but... Uh, 47 right now is getting the job done for me. I ain't gonna lie to you guys, okay? Uh, we have a standard dunk over 40, and let's go down to the strength. Of course, y'all know we're gonna get that 74 strength, and 82 vert is going to give us the contact dunk, so don't make the mistake of not taking your vertical up high enough. Vertical has something to do with the contact dunks and posterizer. Look, if we take the vertical down to a 79, guess what? You don't get gold posterizer, so don't make the mistake, okay? And that's just what it is. Um, we're going to go back up. And as you can see, we do get gold posterizer, Hall of Fame Slithery, Hall of Fame Bunny, Spence like a two-step, really great badge to have. We also get Area Wisdom Precision Duck on gold. So that's pretty good, too. As you can see, um, pretty good finisher, man. You know, um, um, if you want to have some fun, man, make you a slasher. I don't care if it's a, a tall slasher or a, a slasher, a point guard, a shooting guard, a center. It does not matter, man. Make a slasher so you can go out there and have some fun. But let's go ahead and get it to the green bean. Make your girl screen badge. This build does have a three-point shot of a 77. Keep in mind, uh, we don't want to change the name of the build, so we left it at a 77. And the mid-range shot, pretty much the same thing. We don't want to change the name of the build. So we took it to a 72 to at least give you guys silver Meeting Magician, okay? We do have a little free throw on the build as well. And as you can see with that 77 three-point shot, it's not super high, um, you know, especially at the point guard position. But I still think you can make some shots with it. You have catch and shoot on silver. You have corner specialist on silver. Clay Moore is on silver as well. You know, you got a lot of other good bads on the build. But you may be handling the ball a lot. Um, and with this build, what I would do is I would shoot when I have to. You know, like other than that, I'm just going to go keep dunking. But you can't shoot, though. So if people think you can't shoot with this build, they're going to be in for a, a surprise because you can shoot with this build. Find your good jump shot, man, and keep that jump shot. Practice on it. Go out there and get get you some shots up because a lot of people, they see a jump shot on YouTube or something like that. They go put the jump shot on, try it one time. Oh, the jump shot trash. But you haven't really even went out there to test the jump shot out like you're supposed to. You know, you just put the jump shot on your bill, try it out one time because you have to keep in mind, you have to constantly adjust with these jump shots in every game mode. Rec is different. Park, Pro-Am. The theater, all of those are different, man. So you have to constantly adjust when you are going out there trying to shoot threes, okay? And when you can't shoot a three, you got that finishing right there. You know what I'm saying? But let's go ahead and get it to the sauce. But before we do, I need you guys to do me a huge favor, right? Go down there, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that share button, and let the video play to the end because that will push your video to the recommended page so everybody in mama can see this video. And I need everybody in mama to see this video. So do that for your boy, boy. Now with the pass section, so y'all know me, man. Y'all know I like to get that passing up to an 84. Some people probably will take it to a 77, and if you want to do that, that's fine with me. You know, if that's something you just want to do. Um, if you think that's enough, which I think it is enough, it can get the job done. You know, but I want to make crisp passes. I don't want to make no um, no beast ball type pass. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to take that uh, pass actually to an 84, so we can get silver needle threaded instead of bronze. Some of you may want bronze. That's fine. That's what you want. Uh, go ahead and do it. But we got touch pass or relay pass on silver, and we also get diamond silver. If you would take it to a 77. You'll get diamond silver. 
uh, relay pass on silver, but you won't get touch pass and needle thread on silver, and that. we don't want that, okay? So um, with the ball handle, of course, you already know we're going to max that out at 85. That gives us the best... Um, some of the best animations for a six foot eight build. Uh, we got ankle break, we got physical handles on this build. Um, we're gonna take that speed of ball to a 77, and we're gonna come down and take the speed and acceleration up. So we can get um, gold triple strike on this build. Uh, we got speed booster, hyperdrive, and blow by. We also get gold physical handle, gold ankle break, so that's pretty good. Now you don't get gold unpluckable if you wanna take your uh, post control up. That way you can get uh, gold um, unpluckable so you won't get plucked like a chicken. I know a lot of people are probably going to be reaching at you, but I don't get ripped a lot with my point guard. Now, the steal, I mean, the turnover that I do get, it be the ones that, like, you just run into somebody, you know what I'm saying? And those, I don't consider those, like, you know, um, something that unpluckable can stop. You can't stop that with unpluckable, you know what I'm saying? If somebody run into you and you lose the ball, that's just what it is. Unpluckable is not going to stop that, okay? Uh, but we still get some good badges when it comes to the playmaking. Being able to pass, being able to get your own shot, that's the most important thing, you know, especially if you're a point guard. I see too many point guards running around with a 70 passing, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't do your teammates like that. I, it, it's just not right, okay? Now, with the defense, uh, we're going to take the perimeter defense up to an 88 so we can get the two-way name, you know, that does to give us what we need. We will be able to get 94 feet. What are we going to get 94 feet on? I think we're going to get it on gold, I want to say, or something like that. Uh, gold to Hall of Fame. I think it's gold or whatever, but, you know, either way it goes, it's still pretty good to have um, 94 feet on this build. We also have fast feet, and we get clamps as well. Now, with the steel, we're going to take that to a 91. You can do an 85 if you want to, but 91 steel is a little bit better. So, um, I would suggest uh, a 91 steel sometimes if you can. But, you know, some people... They can get it done with 85, which I totally understand. I can get it done with 85 on my point guard. That's what I have. But on another one of my point guards, I got 91. And the 91 does make a huge difference. So uh, that's what we got on this build, being able to get gold glove, gold intercept, and gold right stick ripper. Now, I know a lot of you probably complain about the shot blocking and say, oh, you don't have no shot blocking. That's what they be telling me on my point guard. But I'm at point guard, man. I'm going to funnel everything into the paint. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I ain't trying to chase down. I ain't trying to do none of that. You know, I'm trying to play good perimeter defense. And if they get by me, man, hopefully the center's back there trying to protect the paint. And uh, on one of my point guards, I do have a 78, 79 block. But on the uh, ones I made lately, I don't have it, okay? So that's up to you guys on what you want to do with that. But I think this is fine. Trust me. Okay, speed, 83, 75, acceleration, 74, strength, 82 on the vert, and the rest is on stamina. And like I said, we do get gold 94 feet, but let's get into these shades up. Are you ready? Because guess what? I do not clickbait. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now, pretty much same shades up. I ain't worried about the shades up, to be honest with you guys, man. We got what we got, and that's just what it is. But the build name is the infamous two-way slasher. That's the build no matter here, man. Charge!